Creating a high quality mixer like this takes around 27 components, 30 work steps and 100 manual actions. In the Hansgrohe foundry, a brass bar is used to create a mixer blank. It takes a lot of effort for a sanitation company to cast products itself, but Hansgrohe does so, because valuable knowledge lies in casting brass, and form and function should be from a single source. You can see, feel and hear the difference in quality. Can you barely hear anything? Good. A perfect flow of water is extremely quiet. It's known as Acoustic Group 1. Before the brass is melted, it needs an outer form, and the cavity in the mixer through which the water later flows must now be filled in during the casting process. This is done using a sand core made from quartz sand and a two-component adhesive. Just like cookies, the ingredients are baked in the oven at about 280 degrees Celsius, a procedure known as core shooting. Brass melts at just under 1000 degrees Celsius. During the low pressure treatment, the liquid metal is pressed into the form with 0.3 bar from beneath. The hot air can escape upward. The adhesive in the sand core also dissolves at high temperatures. When the brass cools, the sand simply trickles away. In this giant washing machine, the sand residues are shaken out. Once the quartz sand has fulfilled its purpose, it is recycled and reused for road construction. Even the sprues and ridges are leftovers that can be sawn off and remelted. An employee conducts random sample tests to check the quality. The casting blank is then taken to the next manufacturing stage, where it's thoroughly treated, the surface processing department. Creating a high quality mixer like this takes around 27 components, 30 work steps and 100 manual actions. During the Hansgrohe surface processing stage, the blank is turned into a shining, polished mixer body. To do this, the molding blank is thoroughly processed and smoothened. What looks somewhat science fiction like is nothing more than milling and drilling otherwise known as machining. Up to 35 tools are in action. To coordinate all of those, Hans Grohe uses a robot. It's so clever that it can carry out both of its main tasks at once. It mills and drills holes and threads in the blank in order to prepare the mixer. Items such as the cartridge are later inserted here. Any ridges on the mixer body are manually removed. All the brass shavings that are created as waste are recycled. An employee uses air pressure to check the impermeability. If everything is okay, the mixer body is sent to the next stage, grinding and polishing. These processes again involve high-tech machines. At Hansgrohe, there are mixer designs for which precise manual processing is also required. Once the surface has been fully smoothened, it's polished to a high gloss finish with a special paste. The mixer body now moves on to the next manufacturing stage, where it is refined, the surface coating department. Creating a high quality mixer like this takes around 27 components, 30 work steps and 100 manual actions. In the Hansgrohe surface coating department, the brass mixer body is given a robust, durable finish. This is achieved chemically through electroplating or as a further stage also physically through PVD coating. Before the brass body is bathed in the electroplating water, it is placed on a rack. Its journey to the tanks occurs automatically. The brass is chrome-plated during multiple dipping processes, making it hard and resilient. Hansgrohe electroplating involves a complex system with perfectly aligned processes and baths with a sophisticated recipe. Thanks to this quality coating, bathroom products are protected against corrosion, look extremely shiny, feel smooth and are easy to clean. To avoid detrimental effects on the environment, the baths are recycled multiple times. 
the research department works permanently on sustainable solutions. For example, it's reduced the organic surfactants in the electroplating water by 90%. An award-winning procedure. Physical vapor deposition, or PVD for short, is additionally used as a coating. Sounds complicated? It is. In simple terms, a vacuum is used in which a robust metal layer is evaporated. The innovative PVD procedure is not only environmentally friendly, it can also be used to produce surfaces in any desired color. Regardless of how the mixer body is coated, its surface is now ready. Velvet gloves are worn to check the quality. After all, customers should receive the products in an immaculate state. Almost ready, the logo just needs to be laser printed. Now only the inner workings are missing. The mixer control unit is constructed in parallel in the Hansgrohe Cartridge Manufacturing Department. Creating a high quality mixer like this takes around 27 components, 30 work steps and 100 manual actions. The Hansgrohe Cartridge Manufacturing Department is where the mixer core is created. The cartridge can be compared to a car's engine. It has to run smoothly, perform well and always work. To make sure of this, Hansgrohe manufactures the sophisticated control units for all mixer types in-house. What does a cartridge actually do? It combines the hot and cold water within the mixer and regulates the water volume. This is mainly done by ceramic discs, which are simply controlled using the handle. Turn on. Cold water. Hot water. Turn off. The stress test highlights what the cartridge has to do every day. Its work in the home is tested and simulated around 70,000 times. What are the key quality criteria? The motor has to run smoothly, as people want to conveniently mix their water in the bathroom and kitchen, so everything depends on the perfect torque. To this end, the ceramic discs are precisely cut to six thousandths of a millimeter and coated with a thin silicon film, making them robust, smooth and mobile. The discs are surrounded by numerous plastic parts and seals, holding the cartridges together. They're manufactured using clean room technology, that is, behind glass. They have to pass through a sluice so that no dust or lint can get inside the motor. The green temperature limitation ring can prevent the water from getting too hot. Now the handle unit is placed on the top. This transfers the mixer's handle movement to the ceramic discs. The core is now taken to the final assembly stage where it joins the refined mixer body. There you can see how well the two elements go together. Creating a high quality mixer like this takes around 27 components, 30 work steps and 100 manual actions. The Hansgrohe Final Assembly Department is where everything that belongs together comes together. The mixer is fully assembled and then sent on its way. Not quite as quickly as that, of course. First, the assembly line employees need all the individual parts. These are electronically accessed from the small parts warehouse. Here it's not only speed but also precision that matters. A barcode system ensures that the right parts are quickly transported along the conveyor belts. The employees add the parts to the mixer body, the cartridge, aerator, handle, supply hoses, etc. The customer specifies what is assembled when and in what quantity. Depending on the order intake, the team processes specific products. Assembly systems, designed and constructed in-house by Hansgrohe, are tailored to its own range, enabling optimum workflows. However quick and flexible the assembly process, the focus is always on accuracy and quality. Finally, the installation parts and manuals are added. The weighing process confirms if the package contains everything it should, no more and no less. The mixer arrives at the central warehouse in Offenburg, ready packaged. From there, it embarks upon its journey to Singapore or Sao Paulo, Cape Town or Kiel.